Whenever you talk to a group of your peers, any any speaker says they're not a little apprehensive is probably not telling the truth. So you're always a little nervous and a little tense. So with a group this size, maybe you can help me out, relax a little bit. If I look over here and look at you, maybe you could kind of smile at me a little bit. <laughs> it may mean you're just having a little pleasant gas pain, but it, I, I, you know, I, I take it differently. And maybe over here, if I look over in this direction and, and I'm doing okay, just kind of nod, and, and that'll make me feel really good. And if I happen to look at you and you're a, you're a smiler and a nodder, oh baby, I'm going to feel so good. I may not know your name, but boy, I'm going to thank you forever. So welcome to this class. It's an honor you've showed up here for me to talk to you and impart anything that might be of value to you. I happen to think that this particular seminar might be classified as one of the most valuable seminars during this entire weekend. A lot of folks are out there teaching you how to do different things with hypnosis, and that's wonderful. And we need to know all those things, especially the ones that work. But you know, all of those things aren't going to do you a hill of beans unless there's somebody in that chair to do them on, is it? No clients, no business, no food, no rent, no pay to phone, no wife, they left for somebody with money. <laughs> and you're kaput. So, wouldn't it be wonderful if you were able to discover a method that basically if somebody's looking for a hypnotist, that they just pretty much got to call you. And this is an awesome capability to have over the guy next door, your competition type of a thing. So let me explain to you how I discovered a technique that does exactly that. See, this is just a one technique kind of a seminar. I was reading one night back in, I think it was 1977. And I always loved to study marketing and other people's capabilities in marketing. So I was reading the greatest marketing book ever written in the United States. Right? And it, it's, it's so great that you I pay for it every year to get the new upgraded marketing manual. I, I, you all probably buy this book. I don't have to beat this one to death. It's called The Yellow Pages. Oh, Apple, salutely. The Yellow Pages. What you do is you sit down, you grab the Yellow Pages, put your feet up, maybe have a nice martini or a glass of wine or Coke or whatever. And just start with the letter A and just kind of look at the ads. And as you do, every once in a while, some creative person is going to have one in there and you're going to go, whoa, that's really nifty. Nifty is a 50s term for you young people. Well, I was looking through it and I, of course you don't do it all in one night because you want to savor the flavor of these ads, you say. Anyway, I get to the letter P and here I am romping around the psychologist advertisements. Never thinking that I would find anything of value under psychology. Well, it just goes to show me how wrong I can be. I see this one ad and my mouth dropped open and I knew I found a gem, but I didn't know how much of a gem this was. So I took a break and I got up and walked around and kind of cleared my head while I was thinking of it. And the more I, 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 I thought about this, the more the, the idea